This bird right here on the right is named Fire Eyes. She's one of our favorite hens. She's really friendly, really nice, but she's getting old. And unfortunately, she has been having trouble. First and foremost, she was picked up and attacked by our neighbor's German Shepherd several weeks ago. Maybe a couple months ago at this point. It took her about 10 days on the back patio to recover. She had a pretty big wound on her back under her wing and then again on her stomach from his top and bottom canine teeth. And recently we witnessed her standing in the pond over yonder which had water in it and not only one but two, not only two but three roosters came up to mate her and they forced her face down into the mud and they got in a little fight on top of her and it was awful. Her whole face was covered in mud, her beak, everything. So she's getting old, weak, and slow. She's a lover, you can tell. She's sitting here grooming one of her fellow hens. Anyway, she's the, she's the elderly one on the property and she will probably become soup soon. So... I just wanted to point her out because there is a cycle of life that takes place and in a protected and controlled an environment like the one we live in, she's probably living a lot past her prime, a lot longer. Um, the German Shepherd would have killed her if I hadn't been there to protect her, to stop it from taking it further than he did. So there's Fire Eyes and one of her sisters. This is Slapjaw. We almost slaughtered her because of her scissor beak. Let's see if we can get a picture of that. See how her beak doesn't shut straight all the way. Something happened when we were out of town and we considered slaughtering her because we didn't think she'd be able to eat. But thankfully, she can eat. And she's been alive about a year and lays some of the biggest eggs that are on the property. So, always tough decisions. We do the best we can. We love all our birds very much, especially the ones we eat. Catherine Bleich signing off. Update on the chickens. Blush Family Farm. SovereignLiving.tv in the center for natural living.